Hey, I don't. Uh, okay, so this was for Vic Miller, and this was a $50 skip the line. Uh, so I want to do this in a reaction because I love doing the uh, classic rock on my channel. And given the fact that Meatloaf just passed away last month, man, damn, the end of last month on the 24th of COVID nonetheless. It scares me. It really does. Um, I don't know. I, I'm not the one, though, who's going to tell you guys what to do, whether it be the vaccination or not to vaccinate yourself. I'm just use your your best judgment uh, as far as that. So if you guys have never been here while I do a reaction video, this is how it's done. It's super easy. Watch this. What's up, guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Just Jen. That's me, Meat Loaf. Yes, we lost the poor guy at the end of January this year uh, due to COVID. And God, I don't, I can't say enough things about that uh, virus. But instead of getting in this big long spiel about how I feel. I'm just going to get into this reaction video. This is for Vic Miller. And during my live streams, we people can skip the list. And this one accidentally got shuffled and lost in the shuffle. And I'm doing this in a reaction video for him today. Because number one, I love Meatloaf. I grew up listening to him. And this one I've never seen before, never done it before. It's called Saturday Live. And I thought it was like Saturday Night Live because, you know, word association when you see it. But this is with a guy named Stephen Fry. So... Without anything further for me, I think we should go back to the 70s. What a great era, right? <laughs> Look at the clothes. Oh, Eddie! Yo, freeze you badass mother lover. I'm one heavy dude with this blade, and I'm gonna cut your ass because you're fooling with a man now. I'm cool, and I'm gonna burn your ass. And you, I'm gonna can your brain if you don't give me everything you got, you dig? <laughs> I'm terribly sorry, I'm fitted in for a word of You mind repeating yourself? He's like, what kind of shit is that? See or something, man? Come here! I said, freeze, you bad ass mother lover. I'm gonna tell it, dude. Get a blade and I'm gonna cut your ass. You're fooling with a man now. You gotta dig. I'm cool to burn your ass, and I'm gonna can your brain if you don't give me everything you got. Understand now? <laughs> no, I'm afraid it's not. <laughs> <laughs> now look, with this is, is this is cool. I I didn't I don't know if there's music involved in this or not, but this is how it, it, the the prime example of who Meatloaf is. Uh, I don't like to say was because it's it makes it final, and I don't. Oh, I hate to say it in past tense because he's no longer here. But this is his personality. Larger than life. Very theatrical. He was extremely talented. What sucks? It's It sucks that he's not here anymore. What a great loss. But look at the personality of him. Look, saying everything, guys. For real. He's like, do you get it now? Do you understand? And he says no. Get <laughs> now! No, I'm afraid it's not. <laughs> Slowly, one bit at a time. Do you mind? Uh, how did it start again? I said, yo, freeze your bad ass, mother lover. All right, stop there. Uh, yo. Uh, what do you mean, yo? Well, that's, that's clearly some sort of greeting, isn't it? We say hello in English. Hello. Freeze. Well, that's self-explanatory. Yeah, and it's just stand still. Oh, does it? Yeah. Oh, all right. So, hello, stand still, you bad, uh, um, you yeah. naughty bottomed person <laughs> who likes to have carnal relations with his mother. <laughs> Carry on. I'm, I'm one heavy dude with a blade, man. Oh, well, that's perfectly simple, isn't it? Uh, I'm a fat person with a kitchen knife. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so this must be some kind of a, uh, like a, a, a talk show of some sorts, maybe a, a comedy skit show, uh, maybe in England. I don't know. I've never heard of Saturday Live before. We've got Saturday Night Live here. Uh, and this is hilarious. This skit is hilarious. So he's basically trying to mug him with some slang, and he's absolutely has no idea. Culture is one hell of a, <laughs> like, you can't even. He's like, I just don't understand what you're saying. What he means to say is, stand there and just give me your wallet because I have a knife to your neck. 
And he, this is funny because he has absolutely no idea what he's talking about. I mean, if somebody comes up to you with a knife, just give him what you got. That simple. <laughs> he ain't having it though. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna cut your ass, boy. <laughs> you're fooling with a man now. Oh, I'm going to slice your bottom because you're playing around with an old gentleman. <laughs> Listen, I'm cool. I'm gonna burn your ass, Jim. Uh, Stephen. Oh, me. <laughs> me. How you doing? Glad to meet you. Sorry, uh, I'm, I'm chilly, so I'm going to set fire to your bottom, uh, Stephen. Uh, and then we're nearly there. What was the last one? Uh, you've lost your mind. Listen, I'm going to can your brains if you don't give me everything you got now. Can? Oh, yeah, can. Uh, John. John, no, Stephen. No, John. Stephen, with a PH. Men's room. Men's room. Oh, lavatory, lavatory. <laughs> I'm going to put your brains in the lavatory unless you give me all your money. Yes? That's right. Uh, now, can we have it all again so I can understand it? What, are you crazy or something? Now, come on, please. Just, just one more time. So you can understand it, I suppose. Yes, please. Okay. 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 The other sign, please. There you go. Oh. <laughs> oh. Uh, hello. Stand still, you bad bottomed person, right, so far? Yes. Okay. Who enjoys carnal knowledge with his mother. My mother. Oh, man. Okay. You're a fat and I'm a fat person, person with, with a kitchen, kitchen knife. knife. <laughs> oh, man. And I'm going to cut your bottom. Yes. Because I'm playing around with older men. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> and and I, then I'm going to... You're chilly. I'm chilly, that's right. So I'm going to burn your bottom. To my that's bottom. exactly right. Yes. And then... Then you're gonna put I'm going to put brains your brains in the, in the, laboratory, the laboratory and you're going to give me, dig this, you're going to give me all your money now. Ah. What do you mean? Ah. Why didn't you just, why didn't you just say something? All of you should have, this is hilarious because it, this looks like it's, what is that, improvisation that they just went at it. This is funny. This is who he was. He wasn't just a musician. This dude was hilarious. Absolutely. This is what he was. So theatrical and fun. Absolutely fun. Just walk up to him and be like, give me your money. I'm robbing you. <laughs> Simple. Easy. I think it's hilarious how they're, they're doing this. This is funny. This is what comedy used to be. They give me all your money now. Ah, what do you mean? Ah! Oh, oh, what a corking grind. I've left all my belly rhino round at Mumsy. <laughs> Mumsy, you know. <laughs> Mumsy. Can you tell me what that means? Mumsy's my mother's house. Mumsy, Mumsy does she have money? money? Yes, plenty of money. Does she have tea? Yes, lots of let's tea. Let's get the hell out of here. Right, let's go and listen. <laughs> <laughs> That was cute. That was cute. It was a basically a skit uh, between an Englishman and a dude from America just being like, I'm going to rob you. And they had a language barrier there. How funny. Back then, comedy, it was so hilarious. And a lot, a lot of things taboo, right? Uh, like the, the slang terms and whatnot. Today, you can't really, you know, you won't see that on, uh, on TV or anything because it's just people having fun, making fun of it, making a joke. And it's uh, all too often misconstrued and just, yeah, people don't have the uh, tolerance for comedy like they they did back then. How fun was that, Vic Miller? I thought it was going to be a music video, but you know what? It was even better. It was Meatloaf in his prime, who he actually was, and not just the singer, absolutely hilarious and he put us all into that performance very believable and just it's, it was comedy it was pure comedy wow thank you vic miller for that that was meatloaf and stephen fry with a ph saturday live and I, i'm assuming that was from the uh from europe some some ba some time back in the 70s if i'm not mistaken i don't know i don't know anything about that show so thank you vic miller if you guys are new to the channel you haven't hit the subscribe button yet and if you want more like this if you have more drop them links because they're the the you the the youtubes the internet holds these things called hidden gems. So if there's something that you want me to see or react to, just drop those links down below. Make sure you smash the like button and subscribe. Here's how you do it. That was hilarious.
That was freaking hilarious. Now, I thought it was going to be a meatloaf song, but it wasn't. It was even better. I love comedy. Hey, it's me, Barry. How are you guys? Uh, look, I've, uh, I've absolutely, I get, I get in those modes where I can't even look at your comments. I so, I apologize to you guys. That was cute. That was absolutely cute. I remember that skit because it was one of the best ways to remember me. Absolutely. Just pure comedy. 